up at your front door if you need us to be. We do tailgate parties, we do birthday parties, weddings, we do it all. That's why we're the best. Big boy, everything big boy, everything big boy, nasty. I built this truck to let all these barbershops know I ain't playing no games out here. I wanted to build me something that ain't nobody ever did before. I want a mini transformer. It been stretched to a, a 330 length in the back. See how the bed is sitting out like a snake. I wanted the race car image look to have a race car team, race team barbershop. Let's look, now let's look at the Eastern Conference Finals that we got going on. This matchup we got. We got the Miami Heat going up against the Chicago Bulls. What do y'all think about this matchup and who can win this series and head to the finals? Bulls hey, got, got too much, man. Bulls y'all look at the Bulls got too much, man. What they got? They got the best that can They got big bodies. Big bodies make a difference, man. Also, they got big bodies. Big bodies make a difference, man. Who's gonna be the consistent number two scorer for Chicago? They don't have one. Same. I've been saying it. It's by committee. It's by committee. It's by committee. If you can get 15 out of losing, you're right. You're losing on losing. 15 points. He can get 15 against against Chris Bosh. Every other game. Who don't play defense? You got Derrick Rose destroying Mike Bibbins. Come on, man. I'm about to say, you gotta be impressed with him. That kills everybody. That's all I'm saying. Everybody's on the mission. That's all I'm saying. Everybody's on the mission like LeBron right now. But this last series, LeBron's the bigger mission than everybody right now. Dwayne Wade averaged 30 points a game. LeBron was averaging 28 points a game. You gotta think these dudes are playing, like you said, on a mission right now. It's, old it's gonna be hard to stop it. They play it's old men, man. Man, come on, man. Y'all kill me with these excuses, man. No excuses, the truth. Who they didn't play old men in the first round? Who they played in the first round? Philadelphia? Nobody. They don't lose to nobody. Nobody. Exactly. Yeah, I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose to nobody. Exactly. The Bulls haven't been exactly blowing people out in the playoffs either. I mean, they struggled against the Pacers. Then they let the Hawks come in and win Game One oh, in Chicago. So I mean, oh good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. They beat the Magic after the Magic demolished them last year. But then they laid down in this last game against the Bulls. I mean, what y'all think about that? They need to get rid of some of those small forwards. Mm -hmm. They got a team for a small forward. Exactly. They, they need a true, they need to go get Jeff T some points in the playing time. Mm -hmm. Get him a real two guard. True. And get rid of some of those small forwards. True. And just get him a small forward and roll with it. Of the core three players, I would say Josh Smith, Al Horford, Joe Johnson. Which one of those pieces is movable? Obviously not Joe, but of the two who. If you gotta give up somebody, Josh ain't leaving. Hey, Josh ain't leaving. You, you can't move, Josh. Josh fill up the stat line every night. Yeah, bro. Regardless I mean, of you all can't the bad shots he take, yeah. all the shots he misses, you can't replace him. You can't replace him. Because you take off that team, you ain't got no you ain't control. Got no, yeah. I'm yeah. got a good team, man. Yeah, they they got, got a good team. I don't think you gotta get rid of nobody. You just gotta pull up some of these trucks. Hey, I'm telling you. That's it. If Atlanta close half the close, and I'm telling you, that team would be awesome. <laughs> My take is you get rid of Marvin Williams, you get rid of some of those, some of that trash on the bench, you give up, uh, I give up whatever they want. You know, but you have to understand. Three. You know what they need to do? Where we not understand. They need to get a refund back from Joe Johnson. That was too much money. That was too much money. They need to give some of that money to new players. They need to give some of that money back. So what did we learn today? We learned that the Hawks have some serious questions that they need to answer. The Bulls just might be able to push the heat to the limit. And when it comes to the mobile barbershop game, Ernesto's Cuts definitely has it on lock. As always, I would like to thank Converse for hooking us up with the fresh shirts and the fly kicks. And until next time, I'm Khalil Thompson, and this has been Talking Shop.